So we have to have this meeting again. Yeah. Are you complaining again? Oh my gosh. Oh. You guys. Oh my gosh. I mean, he's sweet. Hey. My hairs are turning gray because of this dude. I can tell. Guys, he is That's a like, VP. Gross. He's worked really hard to get where he is. So yeah, he works really we... hard to take up two parking spots? I'm um, done. Seriously. Oh my gosh. You sucks. guys. It's a nightmare. He is the VP, guys. It comes with perks. So what? Perks like two what? parking spots. So! Give me the good news in the sales forecast, ladies and brosips. Well, we, uh, we closed a Kraus account. Boom! Winning! Fist bump! All right! Bartholomew, if that's your real name, waves in training! All right! Who are you? John Moses. Do you work here? For two years. Two years? Yeah. Why have I not seen you working? Hmm? Hmm? What do you got over there, pretty and pink? I'm tweeting. Excuse me? Excuse, excuse, excuse me? Do pay attention. You got that? Good. All right. My secretary, Mr. Eugenie in a bottle. Are you getting all this? Ooh, little flab there. You might want to take care of that if you want to make your way up the corporate ladder, son. You're not going to have a Pillsbury Doughboy working in my office. So, we need to get out there and sell, sell, sell that technology. It's not going to sell itself. Break. I love my job. Hey, buddy, Eugene. Let's talk offline about you putting your best foot forward. You might want to put a little bit more pep in your step. What's wrong with my steps? I know how to walk. Well, it's not your steps. It's your shirt. Because this shirt will not do. Okay? I like it. I don't, pig pen. tonight. You ready? Yeah. Word. Hey, man, I have been working on some words. Can't wait for you to see it. I see what you did there. I see what you did there. All right, man. Do it. Yeah. All right. Eugene, hi. How are you? Uh, I'm good. Uh, really good. Uh, super. The usual? Yeah, hot chocolate on the rocks, easy on the whip. I'm trying to quit. <laughs> You got it. I smoke a light whip coming right up. I'll put it on your tab. Oh, thanks. You know what? I'll set aside a nice chunk of change for you. You didn't give me any tab, remember? Oh, duh. Hey, break a like up there tonight. Yeah, you too. Oh. Wait a second, you too? Hey, Chris. Yeah, what's up, man? How do you have so much swagger? Was there a workshop that I missed? A swagger workshop? Um, no, no, no workshop. Well, all I know is you have real conversations with real girls. You know what? They basically just come to you and give you anything. Uh, I don't know about giving you hey, anything. I got an extra scone. I was wondering if you'd like it. I do want your extra scone. <laughs> oh, thank you. But extra scone for me. Do you know her? Not yet, I don't, but as soon as we're finished here, I'm going to get to know her. That's what I'm talking about. Dude. Everything just seems to fall into place for you. It's just a scone. Just a scone. This whole talking to ladies, you can get up in front of a crowded audience, rock the mic, take that energy, channel it, and just let it flow. It's, it's natural. It just, it just happens, like the scone appearing. It, it'll just happen. You do give good advice, and uh, I must say, you are pretty sincere when you want to be. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Just kind of keep that between you and I. You're my boy, so I got to take care of you, but I don't like where I think you're headed with this sincere. Christopher. <laughs> here, here you go, here you go, here you Would go. Would you like some passion tea okay. to go with those feelings that you have? Passion tea, really? You know yo, what? yo, yo, yo! Yo, yo, it's your boy, Anthony, and I'm the MC tonight here at Northwest Coffee. This is going to be exciting, y'all. Here he comes. He's the best. It's the open mic night, and he's going to drop it. He's the man's uh, with the stanza. You know, George Costanza, more like Tony Danza, the boss, Eugene Mitchell's son. <laughs> Go 
outside while the sun has you in trance, watches the trees sway as if they were to dance. Night is falling, birds are calling. Off to sleep you go, my little darlings. Thank you. Thank you. It's on the house tonight. Hey, can we talk after? Talking? Yeah, I, I like talking. Uh, Great. Really looking forward to it. Hey, good luck up there. Thank you. Uh, Eugene. I'm back! Like to the future! This is your boy Anthony. I am the MC here at Northwest Coffee. It is open mic night tonight. Who's gonna drop it? I think it's gonna be my boy. He's coming up next now. He is the poetic Mac Attack. He is like the dude Emily Dixon. Ladies and gentlemen, you did Mitchell Song! <laughs> he waits nervous in the wings as the church piano starts to sing. Here comes my bride. All dressed in white. Tonight, this woman will be my wife. I'm so blessed to be her husband. This is what I've always wanted. Only God knows how we feel. He knows it's something real. Our love will last forevermore until we close that casket door. Thank you. Oh, I did it. Dude, who, who are you right now? Like, <laughs> what? I don't know who that was. You crushed <laughs> it, man. Like, whatever you ate, you need to start eating a lot more of that. I'm impressed. Chris, I just have to tell you, man, when I was up there, it felt really good. You know, I was just doing my thing. Look, check this out. While you're feeling this way, full off whatever you ate, you need to go talk to Kelsey. You mean, talk to Kelsey? Get on her, man. You can't lose. Oh boy, here I go. You got it. You were great up there. I mean, really on your game tonight. Uh, thanks. Wow, I've never seen outside the counter before. Oh, you have legs. I do. Two of them. So, anyway, Eugene, I've seen you up there giving these amazing performances. The way you light up the stage, it's incredible. Inspiring, actually. Oh, uh, thank you, Kelsey. Uh, thanks a lot. Uh, th thanks a ton. Uh, an elephant I, ton. I get it. <laughs> totally with you. So, anyway, I know this is super short notice, and I know that I, I don't know you that that well. Ugh, why am I so nervous? Do you ever get nervous? No. <laughs> a anyway, so. My sister's getting married this weekend, and, and I'm the maid of honor. It's a long story. And, and I wouldn't even be asking if I didn't think you'd be interested. But would you, would you fill in for yes. the minister? You will? Eugene, I can't believe you said yes. The minister accidentally double booked himself. I cannot believe you just said yes, Eugene. You are gonna make the perfect minister. I cannot wait to see you in action. You have just made me the happiest girl on the planet. Thank you, Eugene. Thank you. You are a lifesaver. Thank you so much. Thank you. You told her you were going to do what? I said yes without thinking. Yeah, you weren't doing much thinking. Oh, Chris, I am dead, man. I need help. Can you help me, please? Eugene, oh. you said yes, son. You said yes to the dress. Do you know what that means? Do you know the power of the words that you've promised to Miss Kelsey? You made a promise from in here, son. From deep down in here. Can you feel it in your soul? If so, stand up and preach thy word to the congregation. <laughs> oh, you're a funny one, Chris. I know. But you know what? I need to get my certification now. <laughs> Wait. I got it. She's going to kill me. She might, but, but She's gonna kill me. I, I know what we can do. Please, tell me. Go forth to the internet. Oh, 
onlineministries.com is waiting on you. Shut <laughs> up, man. I need Dang, help. Hey, shut up. Eugene, that's kind of rough, man. All yours, though, bro. Chris, come on, man. No, no, no. no, you, no. you got this, man. You got this. You'll be good. I got faith in Chris. Faith. Oh. Get it done. Get it done. You're good. Jeez. So much for thinking. Oh yeah, what? almost what done. What the? Oh, hey Chris. <laughs> I am one click away from my certification. Dude, have you even been to bed? No, but all I have to do is press submit and I am good to go. Oh yeah, Eugene, you the man. Oh yeah, <laughs> cause gonna love you. Oh yeah, all right. <laughs> um, hold on, Mr. The Man and Everybody Loves Eugene. You oh. better come read the small print. It says that you won't get this back and be official for two weeks. Two weeks? What are they, on vacation in the Bahamas? Like, no, I, wait, two wait, weeks. wait, wait, I, I got it, I got it. Does it, it. say I, today no, anywhere? Look, forget this, I got no. it, I got it. I know what we do, forget that. Nobody really listens at weddings. Just make sure that you say kiss the bride. All that stuff in the middle doesn't matter. You can do it. Even though I'm not a... Yep, even though you're not a minister. Give me some, dog. Give me some. Bam! I got this. You got this, man. What would you do without me? What would you? Don't even think about that, cause I I don't want to hurt you there. You, you, what would you do without me? Oh, yeah, yeah. I got this. I. Gosh. Today's Saturday. Yo, 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 yo! Minister Man, you up? Yeah, Chris. Today's the big day. You ready? I guess. Oh, come on. You gotta do better than guess. I got a couple things for you. You ready? Mm hmm Okay. Number one, don't trip on the bride's train. You choo choo um. choo. That's the long part of her dress that's dragging down a train. Yeah, right, right. Okay. Number two. Don't drown in the holy water. Who do that? I don't know, but I hear it gets deep. Okay, wait, wait, what's your opening line? It's like, hear ye, hear ye. Wait, wait, is that a wedding or a funeral? Ah, same thing. Life is over as you know it anyway. Brace yourself, this is my final thing. You ready? Okay. Close your eyes. Open. Bam! Oh, Chris, Vitamin man. C, Prime Minister. That is cool <laughs> at all, man. Well, check it, I'm almost late for work. Uh, deuces. Hey, one more thing. What up, dog? What you need? What you need? <sighs> Do me a favor and wish me luck. Good luck. And please pray for me. Dear Lord, pray for Eugene. And the congregation say it. Amen. Amen. <sighs> okay, I can pull this off. Kelsey asked me. Of course she likes me. <laughs> I'm just here to help a friend in need. <sighs> you know, I'm not doing anything illegal. <laughs> People do illegal stuff all the time. If I can do poetry, <laughs> I can play a minister. <laughs> Man, <laughs> I'm about to play the role of a lifetime. I deserve an Oscar for this. A trophy for my trophy wife. <sighs> Showtime. Hmm, let's see your little trophy. Oh, Eugene. Mm, 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 mm. You look beautiful, darling. I know. Ready? <laughs> Meet Eugene, our savior of the day. <laughs> hey, Eugene, 
We are so appreciative that you were able to step in today. I mean, to be able to find a minister this late in the game, our little Kelsey here, she sure did come through, right? Oh, thank you so much. Oh, you yeah. know, I... Hi, Eugene. Bless you. You are our savior today. Mm. Save me a dance, okay? Bless you, ma'am. Oh, that's gross. <laughs> Eugene, meet the blushing bride herself. Oh my gosh, so I kind of do magic. Do you want to see? Sure. Okay, wait, hold on. <clears throat> Don't look. Okay. Uh, can you see me? <laughs> yes, we can see you. Uh, Seriously? Yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, okay, Seriously. hold on. Wait, hold on. <laughs> there's one more person <laughs> I want you to meet. Yeah, Trent. No? Cool. My date. <laughs> Eugene. Trent. How's it going, buddy? Whoa! Don't touch the blazer now. It's worth more than your outfit now. Hi, Trent. <clears throat> nice to meet you. More nice to see me. Wait, huh? you guys know each other? I didn't know you were a minister, buddy. All this time, I thought you just made my coffee and took out the trash. Oh, can you make me coffee? I guess I do a lot of things, Trent. Mm -hmm. Eugene's my friend who's ministering. I told you about him. Eugene is my employee who licks my boots when I need him to. Ooh. Well, small Fresh. world. Okay. Well, Eugene, you're up. We are gathered here today. Um, excuse me, ladies and gentlemen, my mouth is a, a little bit dry. I think I need to go get some water. I'll kill some time while we wait on our good old pal Eugene. Anyone here on a date? You? What about you? Oh, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. But in all seriousness, I've got a few words that I'd like to share, but I'm not a pro like our good old pal Eugene, but I'll do my best. And now a reading from the book of Eugene. I can pull this off. All I'm doing is helping out a friend. So what if I'm not a certified minister? It's just a dumb piece of paper. It's just words. They can't hurt. All I know is I must fool everyone. Ooh, he fooled you all. I would do anything for Kelsey. She's the most perfect girl. I wonder what it's like to... Woo! Eugene! You dog! Mm. Woof, woof! Oh, how much of that did you hear? You must have heard all of it because you're going to need a new set of trousers. How dare you ruin the best day of my little girl's life? I mean, what were you thinking? Do you have any, any idea what you have just done? Sir, please, I can explain. <laughs> you better have a real good reason for pulling this. Dad, can I have a minute with Eugene? Fine. Fine. You're responsible for fixing this. Kelsey, I know I have a lot of explaining to do. I really did think I had my certification, but like an idiot, I didn't look online and realize that it would take two weeks. Kelsey, it was an honest mistake. Honest? Are you kidding me? There is nothing honest about you, Eugene. Kelsey, trust me, you are the last person on earth I'd want to hurt. But you did! You hurt me, you hurt my family, and you have let every one of them down. You messed with people's lifelong happiness. What is the matter with you? 
Kelsey, I did all this for you. For me? You were gonna fake being a minister for my sister's wedding because you like me? That is the most pathetic thing I have ever heard. It doesn't even make sense. You are not the person I thought you were. I don't even know who you are. Wow, you don't know who I am? Every time I come to that coffee house, you treat me like I'm your friend. And believe me when I say this, you're the only girl that ever gives me the time of day. I thought that meant something to you. Eugene, I asked you to do this because I believed in you. If you weren't a certified minister, you should have said something before. But now, now is too late. I promise, I can make this up to you. How? How is that possible? Oh, my boy Eugene. What's up, cousin Eugene? Uh, hey, uh, listen, Anthony, I need a huge favor. What's up, what's up, what's wrong, buddy? Here's the deal. Do you still have your minister certification? That's right, my boy is getting married, getting hit. We're gonna take some shots, 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 shots. Everybody! Uh, no, that won't be necessary. Why is that? Look, I'm calling because uh, I need you to minister a wedding today. Like now. Please, please, please tell me you're available. And I really need you, man. I can come. I have one condition, though. Well, at five o'clock, I gotta be out. I gotta regulate regulators over at St. Virginia's. We've got the bingo championship, the bingo championship. I'm in charge of that, you know. I got that B9. I've got that in 31. I'm on the case, baby. I'll see you there. Just text me the address, you heard me? Oh, my man. What's up? How are you? Oh, Anthony, Good to see you. thank you so much for being here. Oh, I yeah, appreciate man. it. Where the honey's at? Where the honey's at? Where the honey's at? There's some Where the there. honey's at? Where the honey's at? <sighs> yo, 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 yo! What's up, honey peeps? It's your boy, DJ Holy Roller Tony in the easy. Man, we got some fine looking honeys up in her. My man, my man, don't be scared, don't be scared. What's up, girl? Not you, her. No offense. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, check this out, check this out. I got this at Tiffany. Yeah, she left in my place last night. What's up, my man, my man? Oh, yeah, let's do this. You ready for some nuptials? Oh, yeah. Excuse me. What's up, man? You get married. Yeah, boy. Are you even like a real minister? <laughs> oh, girl, I brought it here. I'm an ordained minister. I'm legit ordained in the membrane. Ordained in the brain. When you get a phone out at your wedding. Hey, do me a favor, do me a favor. I Look up, uh, 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 I'm sure you are. Hashtag these nuts. You got what? a number for a veterinarian in there real quick? Okay, why? Because these puppies are sick. Okay, that was hilarious. His muscles are puppies. <laughs> Dearly yeah. beloved, mm -hmm. we are gathered here today. Oh, wait, can you hold on for like one sec? Oh, actually, not you. <laughs> Me. Thanks. Anyway. We are gathered here today to bring one man and one woman into here. Like your shirt. Heart. Oh. Come on, babe. Let's get to the reception. I don't know about you, but I need a drink. You know what? A drink does sound really good. I thought so. Why don't you get in your car, drive home, and go make yourself one. Because you are gonna be alone for a while. We're done. Excuse me? Do you know who you're talking to? You have got to be kidding me, breaking up with me. Look at all this fineness right here. You ain't gonna do no better than me. It must be somebody else. This is over. You old news anyway. I'm out of here. <sighs> what a day. I don't know love Mind if I sit down? Sure. I can't even think straight, and I'm pretty sure I should be mad at you. But Kelsey, it was never my I, intention to. I know, I know. And you know what? You pulled it off. 
not exactly as planned, but my sister got married and that's all that matters. Where's your knight in shining armor? Oh, Trent, he and I are done. Oh, wow. I'm sorry to hear that. Um, dare I say, maybe it's a blessing in disguise? Something like that. Well, I guess I'll see you at the coffee shop. Guess so. Hey, Eugene, would you maybe want to join me at the reception? Yes. <laughs> Are you sure? Because I'm pretty positive the last time you said yes like that. I know. Kelsey, this time I am positive. Yes, I would love to go to the reception with you. Awesome. Happened. Well, Eugene, you're up. Okay. Are you putting your gum on your chin? I got some on me. Get it. That's gross. Will no. you get it? No. Dad, will you get it? No. I'm not your real mom anyway. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I got gum on my lip for real. <laughs> <laughs> 